All right, Shalom. I'm going to start off by giving all praise, honor, glory, as well as worship to Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shah, by Hashem, Rakak, Dash. All right, double honors to the apostles of the great millstone, the leaders of Israel. Shalom to the sincere Akim, Wa Akwathim, as out there listening in truth and humility. And to the elect, Bayath Dawadah, the house of David, and Shabbat Shalom. All right, I'm going to get to a quick topic, Lord willing. Um, this. I'm going to title this um, video, Trials, all right, because we got to go through trials and tribulations, okay? Must trials and tribulations to enter the, king, into the kingdom, all right? Uh, all right, so I'm going to start off in, um, in X. All right, you know, because... Hey, because contrary to to um to most beliefs, like Christianity, or right, hey, we got um, it's not just believe and you believe on so called Jesus and you and you make it, all right. Hey, we got to go through these trials and tribulations, okay. Hey, um, we got to gird up our loins like a man, all right. But this is Book of Acts, chapter fourteen, verse twenty two. It's because it says confirming the souls of the disciples. And extorting them to continue in the faith, and that we must, through much tribulation, enter into the kingdom of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shah. All right, so we gotta um, um, uplift each other, okay? Encourage, all right, uh, can encourage them to continue in this faith, all right? Because um, this scripture is even here because that, that even proves that um, we, we go through trials and tribulations. Uh, um, every brother goes to um, Yahweh Hashem Yahweh is, is He puts every brother through certain um, afflictions and and um, and trials. Really, you know, entering entering into, into the kingdom. All right, uh, and our biggest trial, our biggest tribulation is, is going to be Jacob's trouble. All right, when they implement that mark of the beast. Okay, when you either you you take the chip or you die. All right, but we um we revving up for that. All right, through the spirit, we we getting ready. For, we we getting ready for those times. All right. So, Book of Acts, chapter fourteen, verse twenty-two. It says, confirming the souls of the disciples, and extorting exhorting them to continue in the faith, that we must do must tribulation, enter into the kingdom of Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai. All right, so must tribulation. We're going to enter the into that kingdom. All right. You know, we gotta um we can't we can't be be weary in our faith okay I'm gonna get the book of Hebrews Hebrews chapter 10 and verse 38. I'm gonna start at 37. Um, Hebrews chapter 10, verse 37. For yet a little while. Oh, uh, it says, for yet a little while. And he that shall come will come and will not tarry. Let me start at 36. So I can. It says, for ye, for ye have need of patience. That after ye have done the will of Yehovah Shai, ye might receive the promise. For yet a little while, and he that shall come will come and will not tarry. Okay, so hey, so we need patience in this thing, all right? Um, all right, because we want to receive that promise of Yahweh Hashem Yahshua, which is the kingdom, okay, and to be of that elect number, okay. It says, "For yet a little while, and he that shall come will come, and, and will not tarry." Okay, Yahweh Shai. All right, in the name Yahweh, in the name of Yahweh Shai. All right, he's gonna he's gonna come in a little <coughs> in a little while. Yeah, that's right, man. And he won't he will not tear it. Okay. Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai will not tear it. Okay. Um, verse thirty eight says, "Now the just shall live by faith, but if any man draw back." My soul shall shall have no pleasure in him. Okay, hey, so the just, uh, we, we we live by faith. That's why we're a, a faith based camp. Okay, 
uh, uh, started with the Apostle Tara on down, you know, the brothers in GMS were, were a faith based camp, all right? It's all about faith, all right? It says, Now the just shall live by faith, but if any man draw back, my soul shall have no pleasure in him, okay? And we can't draw back, we can't draw back in this faith. You know, once we put our hand to the plow, we can't we can't look back. Okay, it says that in Luke the ninth chapter in the sixty sixty second verse. Okay. Yeah, how about Shimei Al Shai? He's not gonna have no pleasure in us if we if we draw back. Okay. Verse thirty nine says, But we are not of them who draw back unto prediction unto perdition, but of them that believe to the saving of the soul. All right, so that's, that's another way of how we know that this book is written for the elect. Because the elect, we, they won't draw back. Okay, this book was written for the elect of Israel. Okay. You know, that's why, it, verse 39, we'll read that again. That was beautiful. Um, it says, but we are not of them who draw back unto perdition, but of them that believe to the saving of the soul. Man, if you in this truth, man, we got to believe that that we are a part of that elect number. Okay, we got to have faith. Okay? And don't look back. All right. And good Romans chapter 5 and verse I'm going to start at the top. Go to 6. Romans chapter 5 verse 1. It says, Therefore being justified by faith, we have peace with Yahweh through our Lord, Yahweh Shai, Hamashiach, okay, be, be that faith, all right, we justified by that faith, and then we have peace with Yahweh by Shai, verse 2, it says, by whom also we have access by faith into his grace, we have access by, by faith into this grace wherein we stand and rejoice in the hope, in the hope of the glory of, of of Yahweh Okay. So Yahweh Shah he gives us the access um of of the access by faith to be into this grace. Alright, we into we enter we in this grace period because of Yahweh Shah. Alright. Verse three it says, Now the righteous shall live by faith. Alright, and not only so, but even the righteous shall live by faith. Alright, verse four it says, And not only so, but we glory in tribulations also, knowing that tribulation worketh patience. Alright, verse five it says, glory in tribulations also, knowing that tribulation worketh patience. Okay, so, hey, we got a glory in the tribulations that we go through. All right. Now, let me look at that word, tribulation. Strong's G, 2347. Thelipsis. 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 And it says a pressing, pressing it together, pressure. Okay, metaphors are oppression, affliction. Okay, tribulation, distress, straits. A straits, that straight gate. All right, difficult. Okay. All right, so that, hey, that's beautiful, man. Um, so it says... Um, and not only so, but we glory in tribulations also. Okay, that um, what was that affliction? Perfect. You know, we, we in that affliction. All right, we don't pray for it, but hey, once we go, we if we going through that affliction, you know, hey, we hey, the water Yahweh Shah. All right, all praise Yahweh Shemiel Shah. Okay, knowing that tribulation worketh patience. All right, and patience experience, and experience hope. Okay, and hope maketh not ashamed, because the love, because the love of God is shed abroad in our hearts by the Holy Spirit, which is given unto us. And, yep, and it, hey, it says, and hope maketh not ashamed. Okay, we got hope in Yahweh about Shemiah Shah. Shem, we're not ashamed of the gospel, are right? we? are not ashamed to go out to the highways and the hedges and and proclaim the truth of Yahweh about Shemiah Shah. Okay. It says, because the love of God is shed abroad in our hearts by the Holy Spirit, all right, the Rakakwadash, which is given unto us. It says, for when we 
were yet without strength. In due time, Hamashiach died for the ungodly. Okay, it says, verse 5, I really like verse 5. It says, because the love of Yahweh, Bashim Yahshai, is said, it brought us in our hearts by the Holy Spirit. All right, that Holy Spirit, it gives us the remembrance of the things of 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 all things okay um all right and it, that, that that the holy spirit has given us the ability to um to love you how about shimmy all right so the holy spirit is it, truly beautiful okay uh i'm gonna get a few more scripts and lord willing i'm gonna close out lord willing this video is edifying um, Isaiah 48 and 10 says, Behold, I have refined thee, but not with silver. I have chosen thee in the furnace of affliction. For mine own sake, even for my own sake, will I do it. For how should I, for how should my name be polluted? And I will not give my glory unto another. Hearken unto me, O Jacob, and Israel, my called. I am he. I am the first and I am the last. Okay, so we got to go through the to the furnace of affliction. Okay. Okay, for you, how about Shimei Alashai sakes? All right, because, hey, we, we polluted his name. We're, um, our heritage is, is pretty much, you how about Shimei Alashai is, is his name. Okay, so we polluted it. So we got to, we got to go through the, through the afflictions, all right, to, um, to to make his name clean, and he's gonna, and he's gonna be glorified in the end by being us being um delivered out of the North Country, all right, Babylon, okay, um, so called America, okay. And Yahweh, Yahweh, he's not gonna forsake us, all right, you know, because he's gonna make his name magnificent, all right. Um. I wanted to get Yeah, I'm gonna get one I'm gonna get one account in Job and I'm gonna close out. Alright, this is the book of Job chapter two, verse seven. So when Satan forth from the presence of Yahweh and smart Job with sore boils and from the sole of his foot onto his crown. And he took and he took him a pot a pot shred to scrape himself withal, and he sat down among the ashes. Then said his wife unto him, Doest thou still retain thy integrity? Curse God and die. Okay, so so um Yahweh Shem Al Shah he he sent forth Satan you know, to um to smite Job with the plagues of, of boils, okay? But um Yeah, I'm gonna read verse ten. But Job he he maintained his integrity because in verse ten it says, But he said unto her, Thou speakest as the foolish woman speaketh. What? Shall we receive good at the hand of Yahweh Shem Al Shah? And shall we not receive evil? And all this did Job, and all this did not Job sin with his lips. Okay, so Job he he read, he maintained his integrity. All right, he he knew that uh, you go through good and the bad with Yahweh Hashem Yahusha. All right, because Yahweh Hashem Yahusha he controls good and evil. All right, so he's he's ultimately he's bringing you through the evil, you know, to um for something that's bigger. All right, but you got to maintain that faith. All right, and I'm going to close out with Isaiah 45 and 7. It says, I form the light and create darkness. I make peace and create evil. I, the Lord, do all things. So, Yahweh Shemel Shai, he creates light and darkness. All right, he does evil and he does good. All right. I'm going to just read verse 9. I saw that. Um, it says, Woe unto him that striveth with his maker. Let the posture strive with the posture with the posture of the earth. Shall the clay say to him that fasteneth, What makest thou or thy work? 
he has no hands. Okay, so hey, we can't we can't um try to strive with the with Yahweh Shimei Al Shah. You know, he does what he does. Hey, just let it be. All right, there's no unrighteousness with Yahweh Shimei Al Shah. All right, we so we gotta go through these trials. Okay. Um, let me just get John too. Salak here. Hey, cause. This is a, this is John chapter four verse thirty four says Yahweh Shai said unto them, My meat is to do the will of him that sent me and to finish his work. All right, so we gotta if we put our hand to this plow, if Yahweh Shimei Shai he opened you up to this truth, okay, um, the gift of the Rakah Kodash, okay, and we we can't um we we can't look back. We gotta finish the work, okay. Uh, amidst the trials and tribulations, all right, we gotta steady elevate trials amidst trials and tribulations, okay. All right, um, Lord willing, this video is edifying. All right, I'm, I'm gonna give all praises to Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shah, by Hashem, Rakah Kodash, the honors to the apostles and others, the great millstone, the leaders of Israel, and Shalom to the sincere Akim Wa and the elect, okay. The, the 144K, the house of David. All right, shalom on to the next lesson.